Gentlemen, let's get down to business. I felt a great disturbance in the force. No one, and I mean no one, comes into our house and pushes us around. Let's talk about something important. Are they all here? All but one. Well, I'm going anyway. Let's talk about something important. This party's over. Let this be a reminder to you all that this organization will not tolerate failure. Perhaps I can find new ways to motivate them. We're Americans with a capital A, huh? You know what that means? Do you? That means that our forefathers were kicked out of every decent country in the world. We are the wretched refuse. We're the underdog. But we're American soldiers. We've been kicking ass for 200 years. We're 10 and 1. <laughs> My mom always said, you got to put the past behind you before you can move on. We've got a lot of work to do. Well, life all comes down to a few moments. This is one of them. The time has come for someone to put his foot down. I am not going to sit on my ass as the events that affect me unfold to determine the course of my life. I'm going to take a stand. I'm going to defend it. Right or wrong, I'm going to defend it. Oh, have I got your attention now? Want some action? Mad, you son of a bitches! Get mad! It's time to get to work. Get off your ass! It's just you, me, and Uncle Sam. So you better hit them monks, my little babies. Tomorrow is another day. Will you fight? No! We will run! And we will live! Shame on you! This could be the greatest night of our lives. And I guarantee a week won't go by in your life. You won't regret walking out, letting them get the best of you. Well, I'm not going home. We've got too far! And I'm gonna stay right here and fight for this lost cause. Are you ready for a war? A day may come when the courage of men fails. But it is not this day. I get nowhere unless the team wins. The line must be drawn here. This far, no farther. I'm not saying it's gonna be easy. Come on. Look what they're up against. You're gonna work harder than you ever worked before. But that's fine, we'll just get tougher with it. If a person grits his teeth and shows real determination, failure is not an option. If you put your effort and concentration into playing to your potential to be the best that you can be, I don't care what the scoreboard says, at the end of the game, in my book, we're gonna be winners. That's how winning is done. Believe me when I say we can break this army here. And win just one for the Gipper. But I say to you, what every warrior has known since the beginning of time, you've got to get mad. I mean plumb mad dog me. If you would be free men, then you must fight to fulfill that promise. Let us cut out their living guts one inch at a time. And they will know what we can do. <laughs> Let no man forget how menacing we are. We are lions. You're like a big bear, man. You can this do it. This is your time. Play for the United States of America. Americans traditionally love to fight. All real Americans love the sting of battle. And when you were kids, you all admired the champion marble shooter, the fastest runner, big league ball players, the toughest boxers. Americans love a winner and will not tolerate a loser. Americans play to win all the time. Seize the day, never surrender. Victory or death. Put that coffee down. You have to be closing all the time. Coffee's for closers only. The only question is, who's gonna close, you or him? A, always, B, B, C, closing. Always be closing. I expect and demand your very best. Anything less, you should have joined the Air Force. That's the Chicago. May the Force be with you. Who's with me? Think 
quick. Think positive. Never show any sign of weakness. Always go for the throat. Yeah, we gotta kill him, motherfucker! We gotta kill him! We're on a mission from God. Sky's the limit. Never tell me the odds. Hit it. Cinderella story. Smells like victory. We are not going to sit here and listen to you bad mouth the United States of America. Gentlemen! They may take our lives, but they'll never take our freedom! Yeah.